sometimes you'll have multiple workbooks to work with. So right now I have three workbooks open right here. So I got workbook one, workbook two, and workbook three as you can see. So if I want to stack them side by side, then I can actually go to view right here. And uh, I can also go, uh, go to view side by side and so forth. So if I were to do view side by side, press OK. And you can see that you can view them side by side just like this. You can also go to Arrange All to actually see it in different order. So if I were to press Arrange All and let's say do hor Horizontal and press OK, you can see that they are stacked up horizontally. You can also Arrange All, you can do Vertical and do the same thing, just like this. Arrange All, you can do Cascade to do this kind of an arrangement. So if you want to see the whole uh, set right there, and you can Arrange All and Tiled. So let's say, for example, if you want this one over here, so let's say this workbook over here in the tile, then you simply go to view again and go to arrange all, tile, press OK, and this will move on to on to the left side, the bigger uh, screen right here. So that is how you use the arrange all feature over here. Uh, besides that, you can also switch windows. So if you actually are using arrange all, so let's use the cascade option right here. And then what I can do is I can use switch windows. So if I were to go to book three, you can see that I can easily switch windows from over here as well. Another thing uh, to do it is if you were to go to view right here, you'll see something called Rains All and you can actually uh, have windows of active worksheet. And if I were to press OK right now, you see that nothing actually happens. So now what you can do is you can actually go back over here and let's uh, let's gonna say arrange all over here. Uh, let's gonna go to new window right here. So what it does is it creates a copy of the window right here. So now if I were to go over here and press arrange all and windows of active worksheet and gonna do cascade, you can see that only two of them are actually uh, over here, stacked up over here. So I'm gonna do arrange all and I'm going to say tiled. So you can see that you got the same data on the left and right. So if I were to write something here, you can see that something is written over here as well. So if you want to copy the data from one workbook to the other, this is actually quite useful. So let's say, for example, you have a data over here and you want to see it here. You simply want to copy it. Then you can simply use this out. So you can copy this out here. So let's say I want to copy the same data over here. I'm going to copy this out, control C and control V right here. And you can see that you can arrange it just like that. So that is how you can work with multiple windows over here. Another thing to switch windows is uh, by pressing the shortcut key. So let's say, for example, if I want to switch between windows, I'm going to press control tab. So you can see that now I'm in workbook three, control tab, workbook one. Now workbook two, three, one, two, three, one, just like this. So if I were to press control shift and tab, it goes backwards, just like that. So you can press control tab or control shift tab to navigate through uh, the different workbooks just like that. So that is how you can work with different workbooks inside of Microsoft Excel. Hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like, comment, share and subscribe.